With the eighth pick in the draft, the Edmonton Oilers select from AIK Sweden, Philip Broberg. Cam Cosentino, the Oilers go with the Swedish defenseman. An absolutely fascinating year for this young man. When we showed up in August at the Holinka Gretzky in Edmonton Red Deer, it, you couldn't find this guy on anyone's list anywhere. He was nowhere to be found. Well, he started lugging the puck around and people are saying, oh, wait a sec, this guy's pretty good. He left that tournament and as a result of that, everyone was making him a top 10 pick. At the World Under 18s and he absolutely lit it up. You have to love the bookends to his season. He was named the defenseman of the tournament at the Under 18. So essentially he goes from a nobody to a top 10 to a nobody and here he is now at number eight overall. He's the bookend player for you Sam sure is. I'll say it the best forward skiing defenseman in the draft this year. This guy can absolutely fly at six foot three and people say wait a second defenseman skating forward. It's absolutely imperative to be able to skate forward now in the National Hockey League with how fast the game is going back for pucks closing on defense. This guy is the ceiling is limitless for him and I think that's why he's been picked so high because he has the frame he has the speed. Can he fill into that and play that at the National Hockey League? Kirk, yeah, no, yeah. We met with Philip at the draft combine in Buffalo. He was telling us about a regret that he had in his life, and it was about not saying hello to one of his favorite hockey players. So, Philip, watch this. Philip, welcome to the NHL. Philip, stort välkommen till NHL. Hey, I know, by the way, you should have came over when you saw me in public. I would have said hello. Congratulations, buddy. Good luck. That's pretty cool, isn't it? Yeah, that's awesome. <laughs> I think your chances of running into him again are, are pretty good. How are you feeling right now? Yeah, that was a lot of applause over there. Yeah, it's just an unbelievable feeling to get drafted. This is what you dream about uh, all your life. So it's an honor to be an older now. You were a centerman until you wanted to get into a hockey camp that had too many forwards and you became a defenseman. What happened there? Yeah, it was uh, the coach uh, there that uh, yeah he basically said that you you become a better defenseman one day and then you be center. So I took his advice and I'm I'm happy with my decision. <laughs> As you should be. Congratulations to you. Thank you. But Ken, he had a really up and down roller coaster year. What made him the guy in your mind? Well, he played real good. I was at the World Championships, uh, World Under 18s. I watched him play. Played very very well. Um, you know, he's a six foot three defenseman with skill. Uh, they're hard to find. So uh, um, we're excited. We interviewed him uh, a number of times and uh, did our research. We think we've got a real good player. I wanted to ask you just what's the last couple of weeks been like? You're new at the job. Edmonton's got big hopes on you. Just the preparation for this particular pick. Uh, I don't know if I'm new at the job, but I'm certainly new in Edmonton. That's, right. That's fair. I'll take that. Yeah. Yeah. Um, you know, I'm excited. Uh, it's a it's a great opportunity. Uh, passionate fan base. Um, you know, obviously there's some great building blocks, uh, great foundation there. We've got to uh, we've got to build around it. And uh, I'm excited. And I know there's a challenge. You know, running an NHL team is a challenge for all 31 teams. So uh, there's different challenges uh, in every day, every city. So uh, I'm excited about the opportunity and uh, looking forward to try to build Edmonton into a legitimate Stanley Cup contender. Well, enjoy the new market, if not the new job. Thank you very much, Ken. <laughs> Thanks. Jeff?